restriction. If you will give a stone on another, any stone, that it will come fire. There are two boards, <coughs> match them like this, fire will come. So by bhajan sadhan, this chit shakti is realized. This Frame of Krishna, Krishna frame is realized. Without sadhana we cannot see. The soul is also like this. Soul is here, everywhere. But we cannot realize without sadhana. So this is the example of Chisakti, fire, Tejo. Vari, water. Water <coughs> has two conditions. If it is too cold, then becomes ice. <coughs> and if it is in its natural state, then between. If condition, uh, souls are in natural states, serving Krishna, they are liberated. Always serving Krishna. And if by any cold, so much cold, then they will become like ice. ice. So, if you are forgetting Krishna, going very far away from Krishna, far away means forgetting Him, then our nature will be changed and then we will be liberated in condition from So much attraction for worldly things. In pure Atma, so, only attraction for Krishna is there, only service is there. But now, we cannot be without what? Attachment. Is Kamukta? Some person like in this. I cannot be without loss. Like, huh? Lost. I should must be with lady or husband. But in pure state, only the charm, only the attraction of Krishna. Here only means attraction of Krishna and his issue of chairs. Oh. Versatable way is only Radha and Krishna. So there are two conditions of soul. It by the example of water. Water has sometimes condensed, sometimes natural. And Mardan, <coughs> this earth, it can say we can say in any way or uh, like. A, Dogs, half, cows, we can make from earth. So this body, <coughs> creepers and animals and all things like this, no difference at all. <coughs> but there is also very deep meaning. Tejo bari medang yatra Here Tej, what is the meaning of Tej? Come to Brahma Gayatri. Tat Sabituru Varanam Varga Devasya. Varga Devasya means sir. Varga means stage there also. Here Varga means sir. Power. Attribute. Who is he? Who is she? Srimati Radhika Harsham. If you are not worshipping Srimati Radhika, as a power of Krishna. You cannot realize anything, anything. Whole world has been created by Srimati Radhika, not by Krishna. Not by Krishna. How? Krishna only wishes and all actions, cultivations comes from Srimati Radhika. Actually. We see that Krishna has lifted Govardhan, but actually Krishna has not lifted. Who lifted? 
by left side of Krishna. Left hand and in left hand this left, most left. So Srimati Radhika is always in the left of Krishna. So see. Only Krishna wished, but all actions, cultivations, all everything is from Srimati Radhika. So, hyate yo bar midam, jatra binmayo, tishargo amrisha. This world seems like true, but this world is not true. And we realize it true, and that is why we are attached in this world. But we, if you know that we are part and parcel of Krishna, he was eternal servant. By the mercy of any realized so, then we will have no achievement on this. Like Sukhde Goswami, Narada Rishi, like the associates of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. You know Raghunath Das Goswami? Her wife was so much beautiful. At that time in whole world, Vishnu Priyaji, but he left at Vishnu Priyaji, Raghunath Das Goswami, he left his wife. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, all his years, he likes. You know Vishwana Chakvarti Thakur, he was in Vrindavan, his guru told that you should go to your wife and take permission and you should come here in Vrindavan and then you should do bhajan. To carry order of his Gurudev, he went. And his wife came in a very solitary room, they were sitting, whole night Krishna Katha was going on. Krishna Chakvarti Thakur was telling. So beautiful, sweet pastimes of Krishna, whole night gone. And then he came to again with love and he asked her wife that, may I go to do bhajan? Yes, you can go. No charm at all. So, Vaishnava is like this. If anything charming in this world, how he can have charm towards Krishna? We will have to cut down all this. Vaishnava like a very, like very, Short, short, they cut all these things. This Varga Amrishat Bhamna Shvene Nyarsta Pukka. This Krishna, creator of this, he creates. He enters in this world like Paramatma, everywhere. Like Brahma, he is all over the world. But he is he has manifested so many, uh, like uh, Ram, Baradev, Nishingadev, so many, so many incarnations. But he still, he, with his power, Srimati Radhika and Gops and Gopi, always with a very beautiful Natavar Shamsunda Roop, having his float on his lips. Very beautiful. He always lives in Glog Vrindavan. So I am praying. Satyam Parama. He has told in next day's slog, I will explain further. You should be any Christian. <coughs> One Christian? Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Krishna Krishna
in short I want to tell that in Gita it is has been told in the last slope. Sarva Dharman, not last slope, but last instruction. <coughs> Sarva Dharman Mam ekam saranam brijam. Aham tvam sarva pape bhyo mukshishyam mahasucha. Perhaps all you know the meaning of this is Getting from all the dharms. Really they are not some. Outwardly dharm of sari, this body and mind. You should take shelter. Offer yourself in the Lord's feet of Krishna. That is Saranamata. And this is called in Gita best thing. To surrender. This Saranamata has been told topmost in Gita. But in second day sloka of Srimad Bhagavad, you see what is written. Dharma prajyata kaitavo attar paramo nejma saranang sadang. Vedyam vasto matra vasto shivadam tapatrayo numulanam Srimad Bhagavate Mahamuni Krite Kimba Parerishwara Shaddo Hitya Varudhate Kritivi Susuvi Takhana In this slow and brief I am telling that it has been told that if anyone give him all the dharms, dharms same like in Gita has been told. Give him all the dharms. <coughs> when he hears Srimad Bhagavatam, Paramashatya, what is Paramashatya? Supreme Personality of Godhead, that is Krishna is Paramashatya. His Shakti Srimati Radha is Paramashatya. So, only hearing the Past times of Krishna, that is Srimad Bhagavati, here is Srimad Bhagavati, if anyone. Have heard whole slokas, whole book. Otherwise, you have not read all the slokas, only one sloka. Only half a sloka, even a half a sloka you have heard. Even one fourth of a sloka. Even if anyone has heard. And he is very eagerly and honorably hearing. Then Srimad Bhagavat, Sukhdev Goswami, himself Krishna, are telling that anyone reading or hearing, hear Susubhi means very honorably hearing. Then Krishna certainly must come in their heart forever. Tatkana, not after long time. Immediately he is he has begun hearing and Krishna will come. Undoubtedly this truth in here. Anyone hears with honor to serve Radha and Krishna, serving this slok, then at once Krishna will come and he will be captured in that heart forever. Compare the two slokas. There Mahasucha, Vali Sharanagati is there. But here by Sri Hearing Srimad Bhagavatam from bona fide Guru or Vaishnava, Krishna must come in heart forever. What is Loki you prefer more? <laughs> what? You? You want to keep Krishna here? Or only Saranagati that Krishna will tell that uh, I will give up um, Take away your sins. Uh, everything. <coughs> no. If any man is sinful, he has so many anartha, 
But he has honor to hear Srimad Bhagavatam and hearing with honor Krishna. Come at once, no delay at once. Not a minute. Krishna Krishna has given this assurance. Srimad Bhagavatam, Sukhdev Goswami, Narada Goswami, Vyas, and all our others. So this is more better thing. More better. What is the meaning of that Krishna will be controlled here, he will manifest things here, and he will be like uh, in prison here, devotion will be there. That Gopi Prem will come, Braj Prem will come in our heart. If there is no Braj Prem, Krishna will not come here. So it indicates Braj Prem that if anyone hear this with honor, he may be nonsense is to be anything like so many were like that. But if there is honor, a little bit of honor for Srimad Bhagavatam hearing, if Krishna will go through their ears here and he will say forever. So believe in Srimad Bhagavatam. And we are this like Parichit Maharaj or all Take it to true, more than true. Today, go Pramanandi. I am happy to see so many devotees, new new devotees are coming. So, <laughs> it is new pressure. I think that. We will remember forever, and all the devotees will remember all this what, uh, gathering, assembly. It will be a history forever. <laughs> At all the corner of the world, devotees have come to see your Hari Kathaya. <laughs> and I am giving so much uh, dhanyavad. Thank you to the devotees of Deja that they have called me here and called so many devotees here. Go Praman. Now we used to Arti.
not here in the It is due to our lack of sound. It may be often being regarded not chanting for sound. Then, and we will go to any devotees who likes. This is most of you. In some case, devotees. Devotees are himself a Christian. Asun, Asun! So, if anyone neglect them, like when Gopinath Gopinath and Madan Mohan were neglected, Radha Damodar neglected in Vrindavan by the devotees, then they <coughs> cheated them and they went to Rajyaki. So, <coughs> we should not try to know of all the that is why in Vrindavan, sometimes Utana comes, sometimes Agasur comes. <coughs> why? To renew their love and affection to Krishna. Sometimes <coughs> when Jasuda taking Krishna in lap, here and there, always meeting, then he sometimes be uh, Familiar, complacent. Uh, no so much charm for Krishna. Together, together, they so long time. So Krishna sees that, oh, now she has no so much strong attraction for me. So he calls Putana. Jasudhara <laughs> I'm waiting hard. So at that time, his love and affection revived. Again she sees that all, Krishna sees that all, again, some like that too. Once Krishna was dating, Mother, 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 I want to go in your lap. I want to take your bed. Merciless death. No, no, not very good. At once, Aghasa, our Sakata Surva is there. And again Krishna went in a very miserable condition. And just with our love and affection was the journey. Again, for so many days she could not give up Krishna from her life. Always. <laughs> again anything comes, again Krishna calls it. I do <laughs> So we should not try to be like that, neglecting Harinam, neglecting Tethis, neglecting Tulasi. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Always love is the
came and he tested all kinds of bhakti, but he could not be the process in which the Nephi devotee, that the Kanishta Dikari, will come. No electricity? What are you doing? Who is in force? The moon will take care of everything. Not working? Can you switch off my table? Sure. Check the part. Yes. Yes. It was behind. Just the red one. How Nephi, Prakrit or Kanishta Dikari will come into Madhya Madhikari. And Madhya Madhikari will gracefully come cultivate their practice to Uttam Adhikari. And Uttam Adhikari 
how he can come in sarup siddha bhakti and the sarup siddha bhakti will come what will come into nitya siddha vastu siddha bhakta in bhakta i have explained upadesha mits four shlokas in london and i usually tell them take this loaf and read me this should not give our attention to anything all <coughs> intention should be good if you read anything you should be absorbed in that i'm serving this thing and i'm taking all these instruction in my heart not only to hear by this ear and to speak out <laughs> there is a very beautiful story that in india there was a king named brikma vidya he has so many nine nine jewels <coughs> court jewels all nine were so loved among them kalidas was supreme intelligent one day a person like mad mad man crazy person having <coughs> Don't do anything. <laughs> skull. Skull. Yeah. Narmunda. Skull. Skull. The skull taken in the hand. Fight naked. So much dirty. And he came in the council of the Karnataka. And he put that skull on the desk and told. I have heard that there are so many intelligent jewels in your court. Come in, let them come here, and they should test whether this the person whose skull is this is called skull. Skull. Skull is this. He was intelligent or no, not intelligent. He was full white, full and rusty. <laughs> Eight. Jewels were there, very learned person, and whole council was full of. But none was ready to give the reply. Only this was a skull. Nothing was there. So how to test it? Then that mad person began to laugh, and he told that all bogus persons, foolish. nonsense i heard and i found it here bogus so i am going and he took his skull and was to go in the meantime kalidas came king prayed that madman oh wait a little my <coughs> one of the council is coming and he made answer your question He put her his that is called on the desk again, and Kalidas came. Again, this question was done to Kalidas, and Kalidas took a very long stick, stick of made of stick, coconut stick, you know, Parbuni. very fine, use for burning, and very long. By which uh, is to broom? Sweet. Is to broom? Yes. Mm -hmm. One stick he took, and he went to that uh, skull and put in the this ear, and it went this side. That he told your question is answered. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> oh, he yes, should clear it. Again, King told that I am not uh, uh, 
understanding. He told that if anything comes here and goes here, <laughs> that person is surely a foolish person. <laughs> 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 and if it was not to come out here and to go here, that it was surely a very So this has come of that person originally was very foolish. So hearing all things, but not taking here to cultivate all these teachings are like foolish person. They cannot close, they cannot develop their Krishna. So what you have come from so many distance, very, very far away you have come. Don't take these teachings here and then take them here. You should come here. Well, let follow this. We have not, not, any of on I have not come to gain any worldly thing. We have come here, but how we can develop our Krishna consciousness, Krishna Bhakti. Hmm? Generally we are of Kanishtha Vidyaya. It may be rare some of us, we Madhya not Uttama, Gari in any case. So we are either in Kanishtha Dikari, some of us, you may be Madhama Dikari. So we should try to have you by hearing the instructions of Srila Rupa Swami, explained by Srila Swami. When I am telling Swamiji or Bhaktivedan Swamiji Maharaj, then you should understand that I am telling of my Siksha Guru, Srila Bhaktivedan Swami Maharaj, and your Prabhupada. So, don't think that Swamiji Maharaj is not in line of Rupa Goswami. And what Rupa Goswami has told, he is not telling the same words and same thing. Because he has told so many words. Rupa Goswami has told in two lines. In one is slow. And Swami Ji has explained in ten pages. So he is not telling other thing. Only he is illuminating the same thing. For those is helping or not understanding. So take in the same line. And also I am reading and I will explain Swamiji explanation. So don't think that he is telling other things because these words are not same as Swamiji. Swamiji is not actually telling the same word that Rupa Goswami has told. But the meaning and purpose and the eternal motive is the same. So I am bringing from Krishna iti jasya garing tam manasatri dhichasti cheta pranat bhishya bhajan pranisham sutrusya bhajana bhikya mananya manna nindadi sunya siddhi met sati nisham. Fourth slope was relation with Vaishnava. How to serve, how to uh, associate Vaishnava by six activities. Dadati Pratigarna. Uyam Akhati Pritchati Bhunte Bhojate Chaiva. Sharabhidhamakriti Lakshadam, he has told. I have explained it is. So I am now coming. It is. Krishna it is just a very tam manashad. This is really the translation. 
No. One should mentally honor the devotee who chants the holy name of Lord Krishna. One should offer humble obeisances to the devotee who has undergone spiritual initiation and is engaged in worshipping the deity. And one should associate with and faithfully serve that pure devotee who is advanced in undeviated devotional service and whose heart is completely devoid of the propensity to criticize others. In this translation, article in the text, has Swamiji mentioned anywhere that the devotees should be initiated by me myself? <laughs> has he told that we should deal with the devotee, only initiated by me? Has he told? Either he has told that disciples, my disciples, and their disciples only. We should think that only the disciples of, the first disciples of my disciples are bona fide Vaishnava. But in whole world, <coughs> none are Vaishnava. He has told. There is any particular demarcation line for this. Hmm? So we should not think that he is only telling that my disciples in their what, some so conference society. in Vaishnava society. Even in not Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Sampadaya, even he may be of Sri Sampadaya, Ramana Sampadaya, anyone, any of this Sampadaya, even a person out of any Sampadaya, four Sampadaya, Vaishnava Sampadaya, he has heard anything about Krishna glory, the glory of Krishna. He has not taken initiation or name even, and he is uttering Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna. Swamiji has given example of his friend. He was not in the Krishna conscious society. He was not even initiated by anyone, first or second or anything. He was a famous English magician. Hmm? Magician. He has not left his all bad things, eating, drinking, smoking, smoking, and famous in song here and there. But he has some photos of Krishna in his in the house, respecting, and in his famous. Uh, Sangi, he used to tell uh, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Samiji is telling in his explanation, anywhere I don't remember. Where? Hmm? Also here? Yes, in this report. Yes. But he is telling that we should think in the family of our family. And he should be respected. Whether he is drinking, he is intoxicated, yes. or anything. And if he is initiated by anyone of Vaishnava or in Chaitanya Mahaprabhu family, he should must respect. If he is coming, don't criticize. If he is telling you. So here he is telling Krishna is just a bit. Yes, you should read the part. <laughs> about the main eater. Like I'll read the part read that, that you just spoke about. Yeah. We can see from practical experience that there are different types of Vaishnavas. The Prakriti Sahajiyas generally chant the Hare Krishna Maha Mantra, yet they are attached to women, money, and intoxication. You should know the uh, Paribhasha. 
definition. Definition of the idea. There are some of some of devotees are telling that Narayan Maharaj is Pakka Sahajiya. <laughs> <laughs> but you should hear the definition of Sahajiya. What is this? When they chant Hare Krishna, but they are attached to women, money, and intoxication. What, what thing? Intoxication. <laughs> 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 women, money, money, and intoxication. But you should think. Women here, men and women both each other. Don't think that only women. For men, women, women for yeah. otherwise it will be ex party. <laughs> and it will be offense for women ladies, so devotees. Although such persons may chant the holy name of the Lord. <laughs> That the, the thing that I'm involved in women's, anyone can tell? <laughs> <laughs> I drink and <I> smoke, <laughs> <laughs> or any of the all bad things. I change my sannyasi dress when I come to my home, uh, Manji, and I change the clothes when I go to other countries? <laughs> Even not Singapore also. <laughs> <laughs> and about money? I don't want money. I want your hearts. Money to help. Then who are Sahajiyas? Those who are telling are myself. <laughs> Those who are telling not not falling all these things also they are Sahajiya. All that. So Krishna has given intelligence to think all these things. Don't believe blunder what? Don't believe on nearly words, propaganda, proper, no, pro, uh, rumors. Yes, rumors oh. and so, today in college, only propaganda and rumors are mm. most um, prominent, uh, prominent uh, weapons. Mm -hmm. But it's not a plot. They should be out of these things. Uh, then again. Although such persons may chant the holy name of the Lord, they are not yet properly purified. Such people should be respected within one's mind, but their association <coughs> should be avoided. Those who are innocent, but simply carried away by bad association, should be shown favor if they are eager to receive proper instructions from pure devotees. That's pretty now come to the partner. We will try to properly be established for Swami Jishtha. My English is not perfect, but you should take this sense. You should read in order to purpose. In order to intelligently apply the sixfold loving reciprocations mentioned in the previous verse, one must select proper persons with careful discrimination. Srila Rupa Goswami therefore advises... If any question, you can ask. This is East Gautis. Not a very lecture. I will not be disturbed. Srila Rupa Goswami therefore advises that we should meet with Vaishnavas in an appropriate way according to their particular status. What is the Paribhasa? Definition. Definition of Vaishnava? He has told here Vaishnava. What is the um, definition. definition of Vaishnava? Who has taken Vaishnava, Vishnu Mantra, Krishna Mantra, Ram Mantra, and 
worshiping that deities in by same month, following the rules and regulations. There are all Vaishnava. Is my disciple so he is Vaishnava and all are not Vaishnava? This is offense. This should not be offense is like this. Anyone by birth without cost and credit. We should adopt all this. Paribhasa, Vaishnava. Anyone who is chanting, one is initiated in Vaishnava, mantra and worshipping, that is in that mantra, following the rules, all are Vaishnava. The worshipper of Ram, the worshipper of Nishin, worshipper of Krishna, worshipper of Vishnu, in proper way, but not like Mayabadi. Mayabadi also chant Krishna name, but they are not in proper Vaishnava way. So he is taking Vaishnava. Then, in this verse, he tells how to deal with three types of devotees. Mm. The Kanista Adhikari, Madhyama Adhikari, and Uttama Adhikari. Mm. The Kanista Adhikari is a neophyte who has received the Harinam initiation from the spiritual master and is trying to chant the, ho the holy name of Krishna. One useful thing. A man has taken Harinam. What is the need of taking Diksha? Can you, anyone reply? You? You, 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 sir? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes. What name? Stand up. I don't Then you shall sit. You shall tell me. In the Chaitanya Chaitanya, Prabhupada says to bring one closer to the spiritual master. I go to Chaitanya Chaitanya. In the Tarim Charita Mrita, Swami Maharaj says that to bring the disciple closer to Krishna, Diksha Mantras are given. What is the difference? between Harinam and Diksha. What is prominent? Name or Diksha? Stated Nama Chintamani Krishna Chaitanya Rasa Vigraha Kuna Shudami Chamukta Adnatam Nama 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 You should hear properly and if you want, you can question. That name is not different from Nami. Name of Krishna and Krishna himself, that they are not different. So, it's stated, by chanting the holy name, Hare Krishna, then one can achieve Krishna fame. But Diksha, taking Diksha initiation, Gayatri, then that can take one to liberation, but now can give Krishna fame. So, of the two, even though there's more restriction on Diksha, but actually Harinam is more prominent. Anyone more can clear? You can stand up. Guru Maharaj, due respect, we heard yesterday in the introduction of your Bhakti Rasamri to Sindhu Bindu that in the life story of Srila Vishnu Chakravati Thakur, he was visited by Srimati Swamini Radharani herself to explain that the Kam Gatri Mantra was uh, so important for the revelation of Braj itself and for the devotee to actually have the full realization of the devata of this mantra. So, from my understanding from your good self, I believe that Diksha is more important than Harinam. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Srila Bhakti Vinod Thakur, he explains that... Um, very important the, thing. It is not a very general or common thing. He explains that actually Harinam is sufficient However, is we sufficient? have is sufficient for bringing the jivatma back to Krishna, but in our conditioned state, we have so many impurities and contaminations and anarthas 
So especially, the Gayatri Mantra is very helpful for purification to uh, help us go forward. What do forward. you mean by Gayatri Mantra? Uh, Brahma Gayatri and... But, uh, <laughs> when Guru gives Diksha, then he makes his disciple like his own level. And Diksha means Dibba Gyanang Jato Dadda Kudjat Papasa Sangchayam Tasma Dikseti Pratsada Shikai Tatta Kavidoi. Who is Tattavid, that's all. Diksha means Guru gives Divagan and divine knowledge, Divagan and Kurjat Papasa Sangchayam. And he destroys and burns all kinds of sin. If we take Harinam as before, here there is some sin, but Guru by Diksha Mantra burns all things. Somebody says that, oh, Gurudev takes all sin from sisters, so Gurudev is to suffer. It is not correct. If it common point, no. at one point. So, dik Diksha Mantra will take us up the gate of Vaikuntha, not beyond Vaikuntha. No, this is not my question. What is the difference between Harinam and Diksha will take up the gate of Vaikuntha and Diksha Mantra will give us relationship. And Holy Name take us to Braj. Just like Gopkumar, he gave, he received Gopal Mantra from his Gurudev and he went before up to Vaikuntha. But when he get Nam, then he, go, he went going beyond Vaikuntha. Holy Name is prominent. But Diksha matured the Harinam. I went to cook. I was cooking. Fire was there. I mean, chula. Stove. Stove. Stove was there. Pot was there. Fire was there. Water was there. Everything was there. But not rice. <laughs> Cooking will be done or not? No. No. So take this nam as a rice. But without the help of chulla, stove, stove, water, fire, pot, it cannot be quiet. But if all things are there but not rice there, no use. But if there is rice, everything is right. When we will have all these things, then we can boil it and we will take. Understand? Understand by example? Now you can hear more. <laughs> Name is himself Krishna and Radha. Or Krishna himself. This is like rice. And fire and all other things, to make it realized and to make it, to realize that name is himself Krishna. All are required. <coughs> to purify Myself, not to purify Krishna name. Krishna name is always Nama Chintamani, Krishna Rasa Chaitanya Vishraha, Purna Suddha, Nitya Mukta, Abhinat Krishna is same 
as his name. No difference. Name Kathan cannot be impure, always pure, always chinne, sachidanandana. But according to our stage, we cannot take it as pure name or we can take understand? If we are full of ignorance, full of all kinds of worldly desires, full of uh, sir, so many times, <coughs> full of offenses, then what we will utter Krishna name will not be Krishna name. At that time you are standing on the platform of Maya, Avidya. So that name will not be true. So to get, give a very test in taking name, to purify our heart, to have link, a relationship between Krishna and myself, this name and myself, and to give up away. Uh, all kinds of anartha, avidya, diksha is needed. As fire is needed to boil water, but only boiling water will not do, there's some rice should be there. So, diksha is given to purify our heart and have a link with Krishna so that very soon we can realize that Krishna is Himself, uh, name is Himself Krishna. Uh, so, now you are understand, Diksha is to help the relationship between Krishna and that devotee, that Gopi Janna Ballabhaya Swaha Swaha means I am offering myself and dedicating myself fully in the lost lotus feet of Krishna. Which Krishna? Name Krishna. Name Brahma. <coughs> With first relation that the same same relation with gopis to uh, gopis to Gopi Jana Pallava. By this relationship we should take if name giving of all Sha the Sha the Divyam Gyanam Dadati gives Divya Gyan. But this relationship, this is Divya relationship that Krishna is my Divya. Whether he is male or female devotee, no heart. So this relation, with this relation, Diksha gives this relation. If you are not taking Diksha, this relationship will not be there. And you will not be able to give up all your worldly desires and all that. So it adds and helps. But we share that. If anyone has not taken initiation, initiation means diksha here. Only name. Like Haridas Thakur has no initiation. There are so many examples for this. No initiation. But yet chanting, chanting and being the initiation, association of very realized devotee. Reset to Krishna. But it is there. So we should come to the rules and the regulations. So we must take Diksha. If you are thinking that I am like Haridas Thakur, <laughs> so now I think that you have properly realized this thing. What is the difference between name and diksha? Only diksha is there, but he is not taking name. 
what will be if you are taking not taking name but only diksha mantra take out the krishna name from the that gopal mantra swaha swaha <laughs> Liberation so, and no liberation. No. If Krishna is taken from that mantra, what remains? Nothing, zero. So, name has two function with some swaha, namaskar, nama, sling, string, all these things. Bij mantra, and there are some. Swaha Namaskar. It gives some special kind of power to give up all these bad things. Without that, you cannot. Name can also do, but why you, you should use it? You should not use for this thing. Very little things can do this thing. Why? So, <coughs> name only can do everything, but it will take very long procedure, process. But by this, our rishis, our devotees have been invented. So quickly, how we can develop our Krishna name into Subha Pyore name? And that is why this child is our, in our disciplic order, the child. Now, no. He has given, I am not telling other than Swamiji, or oh, if you are telling that you are not selling, telling the same word, that if I am telling the same word, we cannot understand what are the modes behind Swamiji. Hard for explaining. Hmm. Amadhyama Adhikari has received spiritual initiation from the spiritual master and has been fully engaged by him in the transcendental loving service of the Lord. The Madhyama Adhikari should be considered to be situated midway in devotional service. The Uttama Adhikari, or highest devotee, is one who is very advanced in devotional service. He is not interested in blaspheming others. His heart is completely... No. And Uttama Adhikari is not interested in... His heart is completely clean and he has attained the realized state of unalloyed Krishna consciousness. Hmm. According to Rupa Goswami, the association and service of such a Mahabhagavata or perfect Vaishnava are most desirable. He should, again I am telling you, he should be the disciple of the same guru or any guru. So he is not telling that uh, among my disciples only. Never he will write like this. In any books, in Chaitanya Chaitanya, in Upanishad, in Srimad Bhagavatam, who has initiated Parikshit Maharaj? Who was the Guru of Parikshit Maharaj? They had not initiated him. <laughs> but Parikshit Maharaj is telling that he is my Guru Dev. And he is associating with him and hearing Harikatha from him. So you should think like this. If I am not initiated by, only by my Guru Dev, and he will not be Vaishnava. This uh, <coughs> mood is offense. Uh, offensive. 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 Anywhere. In such sampradaya, especially in Chaitanya Mahaprabhu sampradaya, he is coming. And he is qualified. And he is Vaishnava. <coughs> Even Madhya Madhika. He should be honored. And he should be heard. One. One should. One should not remain very, in the... Very carefully this line. Hmm. One should not remain a Kanista Adhikari... I'm always telling this. Yes. 
some are telling that you should always be book distributing always, always. <laughs> and making money, 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 whole life. And this will take you to Kolok Vrindavan in the service of Gopi Prem. Quite absurd. <laughs> Quite absurd. That was what telling and thinking that foolish. Swamiji is not telling this. That is a sukriti, it must be done. For newcomers, one new five, they must do all these things. What Swamiji has to But they should know. When it is book is to be told not to, they should go deep in his purpose. Then it will be done. A man only distributing lakhs and lakhs births, he will do coming and going in birth and death. He will have some sukriti. Swamiji had not told that one should remain always in a yeah, kanishtadi He had not told. He had told that one should not remain a kanishtadi for always. But we are insisting that this would be like that. And this is the highest topic of service. It is like bluffing them. <laughs> Quite bluffing them. We should not bluff anybody. Why they are then falling? They are blushing persons. For their own gain. 25% giving and 75% feet for <laughs> Swamiji is seeing everything. He cannot tolerate. So we should be, uh, one should not remain in a Kanishta He should try by hearing. And greed will come if he is hearing a bona fide question. If he is uh, cultivating and obeying the orders of Vaishnava, Swamiji. He must be uh, in Madhyam Adhikari. And Madhyam Adhikari will go to Uttam Adhikari. And Uttam Adhikari will go to Krishna Prem. In Vastu Siddhi, we have not come to always be in the same Kalishta Adhikari. And offending, making offenses. Yeah. Anyone relent is satisfied by always being a Kanishtha Vikari. Then one who is <coughs> situated on the lowest. One should now remain a Kanishtha Adhikari. You is should one. all try to become Madhyam Adhikari. And those who are in Madhyam Adhikari, they should come in Madhyam Madhyam. And those who are in Madhyam Madhyam, they should come in Madhyam Uttam. And those who are in Uttam, they should try to realize Sarup Siddhi. Mm -hmm. And after Sarup Siddhi, Swamiji has written everything. Everything. Shramandasha, Varandasha, Smaranudasha, then Bhavapandasha, Shampati Dasha, all he has written. But we have no chance to go through these books, one need to do books. And this will do, take us to that <laughs> So, if one is hearing from Rasik Vaishnava, Rasik Vaishnava or Tatkogya Vaishnava, uh, Madhya Madhikari, advancing from Kanishta to Madhyam stage, then if that person is still distributing books, is that supreme? No harm, no harm. It is, then at that time it is bhakti. This thing to distribute books is bhakti. But it's a level of consciousness of the person who's distributing. Yes, anything. A man is brooming. It is not in among 64 kinds of bhakti. <laughs> <laughs> but it will be the highest topic of uh, brooming in the cones. <laughs> so everything. <clears throat> what we should not do, are we are doing? Sometimes nonsense also for worldly persons. It becomes highest service of Krishna. 
but it depends on that stage. No? So we must try to uh, go in Madhyamadhikari and Madhyamadhikari should try to go in So Swami Maharaj is not telling that one should not remain a Kanishtha Dikari forever if he should go. But he should try to go. If he is not trying, then he should, he, we should think that his association is not good. There is some likeness, leakage on that. Either in his guru, either in himself. His guru is not good. So try to give up that guru. If our eagerness is not coming, our enthusiasm is not coming, and we are not trying to develop our Krishna consciousness from Kanishka Dikari to Madhyama, that Guru should be given up. Then. So one should not remain a Kanista Adhikari or one who is situated on the lowest platform of devotional service and is interested only in worshipping the deity. Only worshipping, 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 thousand years. <laughs> but not serving any high class of Vaishnava. It will not do. If you want to develop, you should, you can do worship. But at time also you will have to develop your Krishna consciousness by association of Uttam Rasik Krishna. Other by you. What? I was wondering what is the minimum qualification of a... Of a you should hear all these things. And gradually are all question will be solved. But here very patiently and very deeply. Such a devotee... Try to don't take your mind on other subject. What here we are dealing, we should try to observe one thing only. Don't go out of line. Only the thing and the thing here. What Swami is telling. Try to understand that word, the deep, meaning of the sentence and his word. Then you, you can tell. A person who is faithfully engaged in the worship of the deity in the temple, but who does not know how to behave towards devotees or people in general, is called a Prakrita Bhakta or Kanista Adhikari. You should know what is Kanista Adhikari. And then take your hand here and judge yourself that in what Adhikari you are. What a stage you are. You can easily think that in part of the car you are. Otherwise you can And then try to get it. Mm. Who is Kanista Dikari? Oh, yes? <laughs> 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 there are no association of any good Vaishnava and while you were sitting and thinking himself that I am um, I am more than him. He will not he will, if he wants to give anyone coming and give him so much money, then he will take that if I am not honoring him then he may go and he will take he will not give money. So I should honor him. <laughs> so he will take the garland of <laughs> and give how? Like this. He will not touch. He will throw it. Like you go to Bihariji Mandir, any mandir of all Goswamis who are Kanishta Dikari, they will not throw to devotees who are with If Sukhdev Goswami will come, not we come, they will throw like this. <laughs> because they don't know anything. They think that, oh, that deity is not mine. So this, this deity can be dishonored. But my this is my Thakur. And this is only to be honored, not all of us. Why they are giving donation to that deity? They should all give to my. He is not thinking that my deity is everybody. My deity is full Krishna. Because they have no developed 
the acoustic contrast. Just to try to develop it. I think that it is now called. No. Gaur Pramanande. I think this will be interesting for you. Yes. Also to, to realize Swamiji. Uh, I'm not telling anything, but I'm telling the words of Swami. Don't think that I'm telling anything separate from that. But one thing I remember, your, your explanation on Diksha, there's one purpose where Srila Prabhupada, he explains, just like you, you have explained about that. Yes. Exactly like that. In Chaitanya Chaitanya Anywhere we, you will see in any uh, authentic book, you will see like this. <laughs> so you should try to, yeah, because I think that you have not so much opportunity to be with Swami. Mm -hmm. And sub practically with uh, uh, direct relation. I have that occasion. I am lucky to have him so more than 50, 60 years. Hmm? So you can't Gurudev Ki Jai! Not Gurudev, yes. I'm devoted. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Krishna Hare Hare. Thank you. 
they began to fall. Many devotees began falling. Then he said there should be five classes a day. <laughs> That's a fact. I'm, I'm doing from the very beginning of it. So, I have very little chance to go down. <laughs> <laughs> She preached to me before I was a devotee. She made me devotee. This is Pilak. She's her husband Navadwi. Yes, yes. Yeah. I'm so Very old devotees of Srila Prabhupada. I become so happy if I meet any sincere and senior devotee. This will try to come near to me to help me. Oh, yes, right. I want help. <laughs> I try to help at every opportunity. Yeah. I, I was able to get some mercy on your first book, I believe, in the in, in the West. Uh, Govinda Lilamrita. Nectar Govinda Lilamrita. Yeah, I was able to enter the Die Critics. Yeah. I also wanted to print it, but I lost that opportunity. I think you had it printed in India. Yes. Yes. I want to again print in, in London. They have yes. a scheme for plan for this. Mm -hmm. I am. I want to print all these books, thousand and thousand. Yeah. <laughs> he knows I am good. I am good friends with Craig Rocker. When he was collecting, I was able yes, to yes, give yes. some donations. Oh, he has helped me so much that I'm always indebted. Uh, eh? He's my inspiration also. <laughs> so you should help. Me. I will. We called Prakashar last night, and his son spoke to him. Good day. In Bhakti Sandarbha. Uh, let me take Prakti. Hare Rama. Hare Rama. Hare Rama. Hare Rama. Hare Rama. Hare Rama. Ah, continue, continue. Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Krishna, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama. So wonderful. I want to uh, give classes like this. You should stay here a long time. Also, we have become so be healthy. My doctor is calling you. <laughs> Mommy. You're our doctor, Rudy. <laughs> he is nurse. He is nurse. <laughs> oh, you are happy? I want to see your dancing. dancing. Yeah. Oh, like that. Yeah. She says she'll dance for you alone in the room, but not in front of everyone because she's shy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Come alone in my room. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Thank you. 
Not only to clear enough, but strengthen the relationship. No? Marriage is needed when there is no marriage. Only it has been told that you will be married to that person. But if marriage is done, after that no ceremony, no, nothing is done. That he is my servant, he is my, uh, he is my husband, he is my husband, he is my husband, all this like that. Hmm? But, this, uh, up to that um, time, marriage is not done. A lady can think now, when will be married? When will be married? Very sweet thing will be. But after marriage, before marriage, if you are meeting to that new coming husband, that anyone can tell her, or says that her, her character is not okay. But after marriage, no date of being again marriage, again marriage. So, when we are in Sodom, don't don't do all these things. Oh, if uh, <coughs> it is needed, mantra is needed in worldly shabhan. And if uh, we have sarup siddhi, and after that we are coming to vastu siddhi, no need of it. Then, my beloved, where you are, like Chaitanya Mahaprabhu called when we went to Jagannath. Krishna Mantra Haita Hai Sansar Mushan, Krishna Nam Haita Pai Krishna Prayam. Mushan means? Mushan means what is the meaning of Mushan? What is no deep? No deep near. No, no. You can sit You will sit five miles away from me. <laughs> what is it, many, uh, that to clear away? The, uh, but not to clear away. Without months, we had no relation with Krishna. In this world, having this relationship, and we can chant name, then we can purify both and have 
realize the, all these things in sadhan dasha and in ripen matured dasha, it will come clear. When my boy is in not ripen, but you matured, not ripen, but matured, understand? Yes, green. Green. Not full, but not. Ah. It has gone to his or say, but there is difference between uh, ripen and between no taste. So when we are practicing, everything we will do in this world. We will learn all these things in Sarup Siddhi and in Vastu Siddhi. All will clear, and practically we will do this. Like very babies having two dolls, one lady and one woman, a uh, man. They make marriage. Very little baby. They don't know what is marriage, but it's still baby. But doing doing so. When they are married, then everything is there. So practicing everything in sadhana dasa. Sadhana te karive jaha, siddhi te pahi veta. What you will think in sadhana? Like, I am friend of Krishna, I am following Siddham, Subal, Madhu, Mangal, I am obeying them. I am very good, beautiful shape of cowherd. And if he will give up this body, thinking like so, a very good a transcendental set will come. And really, you will feel that. Like Bharat Maharaj, he was thinking of deer and left his body. And he became why we will not. Surely. So in Sadhan what we will think in Siddhi the same thing there. Yeah. Ashtakali Lila is if you are doing and serving Krishna in a special mode, that as special mode will come back after that. If you are obeying proper in proper way, yeah, you should come here, always sit here, nearby. No? So, so uh, in Sadhana Navastha of Bhakti, all our activities and uh, all our cultivation are not actually Bhakti, not Sadhana. When we our object is to have bhav bhakti. What we are cultivating our all senses, by all senses, practicing. practicing. Then, having the mood that I will have bhav bhakti, then it will be sadhana. Otherwise, it will sadhana bhash. Sadhana of heart. Sambhati, no? Semblance of sadhana. Semblance of sadhana. Not actually sadhana. Because you don't know anything about sadhana and what is your goal. Knowing all your goals and how to cultivate your all senses of bhakti, then it may be sadhana. And when the object of our mood, bhav bhakti, will be Sarup Siddhi, Krishna Prem, then it will be Bhavati, otherwise not Bhavati. So we should clear all these things. Then we can proceed on Shadhan. Otherwise we cannot do any Shadhan. Only chanting will not do. Those who are chanting, some becomes like Mayabadi, some Sajiya. Some have some worldly gains, some are 
involved in mukti, some go to Narayan Lok, some to Ajodhya, some to Dwarka, Mathura Puri, and among them so rare go to Krishna in Praja. And in them rare to Dasya Bhakti of Krishna. And in them rare to Krishna as a Sakha, Siddhamsa. Very, very rare are like Nanda Baba and and very among them, very rare. What thing? And in them, very rare in the line of Antipasva. We are coming in this line of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and the Antipasva. Sri Chaitanya Mano Vishtam Anyone know it, knowing not all these things, uttering this sloka has no realization at all what the meaning of this sloka. What is this Swapadam become? Even that. So must. I think our classes are going well. Like East Goshti, <coughs> you can you you are free to, to ask question anything. <coughs> and now beginning by Shimat Bhagavat class. In morning we will discuss about the Samrita and all these teachings. How we can enter in Bhakti. Also this will add you. It will make greed. I want to clear one thing more. What is the basic difference between Gita and Bhagavad? Some devotees have the opinion that I don't regard Gita. Myself, I disregard. But this is the same thing with Swamiji, Bhakti Vedanta Sahaja. He had not disregarded and I am also not going to disregard it. But sometimes I say like Swamiji. I have read anywhere you may remember that Gita is first book of ABC. And Srimad Bhagavad Bhagavatam, post-graduate, PhD, last book. Why he has told like so? He has disregarded Gita? By telling. This is the fact. But for witness it is not told like so. Otherwise they will lose their faith. Na janayet karma sangina. Na bhutti bheda janayet karma sangina. Don't disturb karma. They should gradually come to us, devotional services. So, something is told for them. Gita is essential because it is the ground. But you know, you should know this fact. Vyasdev has divided Vedas in four. Rig Veda, Sambhi, Yadur Veda, Thakur. He has explained Gita, um, Upanishads. He has done, compiled almost all, eighteenth, eighth, eighth, eighteenth Purans. Eighteenth Upa Puran, eighteenth Shaka Puran, thirty six Purans. <coughs> he had done Mahabharat, eighteenth Parva, eighteenth huh? huh? Parva, Parva, you know? Also, Gita is ten, uh, eighteen chapters. Of same Srimad Bhagavatam, Gita, um, of same Mahabharata. 
it was finished, it was compiled, but yet Vyasa was not satisfied. And he was not thinking that I am, why I am not pleased? My Atma is not so happy. Why? Gita was there. He had done in Mahabharata. And it was prominent. But yet, why he was not satisfied? So Gita was there, but he was not satisfied. But when Srimad Bhagavat was compiled, then he became happy. But there is something lacking in Gita. It is for beginners, no doubt. But for advanced, nothing is there. There is only Saranagati, which is the door of The door is not itself bhakti, but it gives entrance in bhakti realm. And that is why you know that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu told that uh, Sarva Dharman Pratyajam, he told, and he told that, oh, it is by you. It is? That is why. So Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was dishonoring Gita by telling this. What he was telling? So, doing comparison is not bad thing, not dishonoring. When we will tell that Ram, no, Krishna is supreme personality of God. Ram is same by Siddhanta. Siddhanta tas abhede api. Krishna, Saparupayo. Rasen Utkashate Krishna, Rupamesha Rasasthiri. By Ras, Krishna is supreme. So this is not dishonoring Ram, not dishonoring Mahavishnu or Dvakadhis by telling this. So Swamiji Maharaj has not dishonored Gita. Because in itself in Srimad Bhagavat it is written that he was not happy, he was lacking something. At that time Gita was done, Mahabharata was done, still he was not happy. But there is something like No frame there. How to develop Krishna consciousness? Frame, this system is not there. Only out external things like doing sarnagati, getting uh, all knowing tattva established, in fact, this is the main object of Gita, that we are not this body, we are not mind, we are so, part and parcel of Krishna. And it has not been clearly said that, it has been told, but in a covered way. What has been told in Srimad Bhagavat and Chaitanya Chaitamrit very vividly in the dialogue of Sanatana Goswami, everything is clear that in Gita it is not clear. How to love Krishna is not told there. That is why we are coming to conclusion by Srimad Bhagavatam. For Srimad Bhagavat it had been told that Nigam Kalpataro Galitam Phalam Sakamukhad Amrita Dava Sanjutam Hivata Bhagavatam Rasamalayam Muhuraho Rushika Bhubha For Gita it has been told Sarva Upanishado Gao Dubdha Gupala Nandara Artho Vasa Sudhir Bhokta Gita Matam Mahat Compare this, this look. For the glorification of Gita, it has been told, Sarv Upanishad Gao. All the Upanishad are like cows. Krishna is milk. <coughs> and Batsavan and cough is Arjun. Arjun is in the place of cows. Milk is not, all milk is not for coughs. Malisham and other milks is for Sudhi, Bhokta, those who are Sudhi. Sudhi means 
bhakta. Prabhupada is so still. Wisdom is still. Mind is established, not going anywhere. That they want to become bhakta. In the, they want to come in the line of bhakti. So they are truly. So this Gita is for them, for preliminary, primary <coughs> states. That you are not, this body is not myself, or mind is not ourself. You should tolerate all the worldly things, and you should think that I am part and parcel of Krishna. Mamai vanso jiva loke jivuta sanatana. Be ithiti pragga. Sthit pragga means? What is the meaning of sthit pragga? Uh, what? Undeviated, uh, unwavering uh, knowledge, unwavering That I am sure, part and parcel of Krishna. <coughs> we have nothing to do with worldly things. We should not be attached in worldly things. Be fixed. Do your fix your mind in Krishna consciousness. This is the purpose. Eat, shuk and dukh. Hani, Maran, Jeevan, Love. That death and birth, suffering and sorrows, hot, hotness and coldness, <coughs> all kinds of suffering may come. You should tolerate. These are for very few moments. Mm -hmm. So you should tolerate and always Engage your mind, your body, your soul, everything in Krishna consciousness, all your senses. He is telling to engage, but not engaged still. And if we will offer all practices and everything to the lords of feet of Krishna, surrendering ourselves, then Krishna easily may give all these things. <coughs> and he will make us enter in Bhakti very much. But our effort will not do. Our effort is very weak. But Krishna will be so strong. In a moment he can turn anyone. So we should not have so much faith on our activities in our southern version, but we'll have faith on Krishna. If you are avoiding the rules of Vedic culture, giving of wife, giving of sons, giving of husband, giving of your guru dev, if he is not in helping mood, no Arm Krishna is telling that I will <coughs> excuse everything. You should take shelter in me. So Nigama Kalpata Rurugalitam.